Hey, this is Rico with another how-to video. Let's say you're at a website and you see something that you may want to keep and you don't feel like bookmarking it or doing something else with it. So let's go to one of our websites. Let's go to our Facebook site, which is systemsforone.com forward slash small business success tool. And I'm just taking it off the notepad. Then I'm going up to our URL, straight up, and just paste in that address there and clicking enter and what it does is it takes us to our Facebook page and let's just say that we want it we were reading the discussion here let's go to the discussion session section excuse me and we wanted to we found a business right here that we wanted to write down their address so here you have one here Dr. Carter in Oakland and you have the Lutheran Church of Our Savior Preschool and you have Markovich income taxes. So let's say I wanted to print that information up. What I would do is I'd go online and get myself a free PDF printer. And I have one right here, an address, systemsfor1.com forward slash free PDF. Copy and paste that. And I'm going to bring up another browser. I'll cl type that into the URL and it will forward me to the download there there's a download you pick what edition that you would need for your computer download it and install it in your printer by following I mean in your computer by following the rules of a typical download once you have it installed then you just go back to the page you wanted to print and this is the pr page we wanted the information from and I just click on print Now, for me, it's a default printer with the one that I use. However, if you didn't, if it, something else was your default printer, you just click on it, double click, and that was what it was the PDF. You give it a name, and I'm going to title it uh, Addresses. And click Save. There we go, it's printing up everything. And since this is the free version, it gives you ads. I'm going to click on continue using the sponsored version. Shows another ad. I just close that out by clicking the X right here. I don't need that. And so now in my bottom browser, it's showing the PDF. I clicked on the PDF, and here it is. That's the PDF. That's in your computer. You can print it up, use it as you want. That's just a quick note on how to use and make your own PDF. Thank you for joining us. You can get other business tips by checking us out over on Facebook at our Small Business Success Tools. You have yourself a great day, and thanks for joining us.